In this chapter, I shall tell you about looking up information with VLOOKER and HLOOKER. Some of Excel's most powerful functions are known under the heading lookup functions. They have widely used for looking up information from tables in the setup in column G. On this worksheet, we are about to figure out a tax rate here based on information that we might see in a table that looks like this, which is oriented vertically. Or, in a table that looks like this, which is oriented horizontally. The VLOOKUP function, the HLOOKUP function, which we are about to cover in detail. Next, I shall tell you about finding approximate matches with VLOOKUP. In column G of this worksheet, we need to look up the tax rate for this salary. By definition, VLOOKUP means search vertically in the left column of a table. The table might be on this worksheet, in another worksheet, or in another workbook. Anytime you have trying to use VLOOKUP for an approximate match, the information must be in ascending order if you hope to get coherent answers. So, in cell G2, we can simply start with equals, we look up left parenthesis. Select cell F2. Comma. Select these yellow cells here. Comma. We want to get our answers out of the second column. The function is complete. I'll just press Ctrl plus enter here. And there's the answer. It is 6%, as you would have expected. If we hope to be able to copy this down the column, press F2 key. So, highlight the address of the table. Press F4 to make it an absolute reference. Ctrl plus enter again. Then we can copy this down the column by double clicking. And so we have correct answers. So, it's a great tool to have to look up information from a table. Next, I shall tell you about finding exact matches with VLOOKUP. In this worksheet, we'd like to use column F. Here to convert the scores we see in column E. There's a table over in columns A and B. Excellent is 99. Very good. 92 and so on. This fair rating that we see here in E2 should be a 71. It currently is giving us the answer 99. Press F2 key. And the VLOOKUP function that's already in place isn't working. So, when a VLOOKUP function or an HLOOKUP function is using an exact match scenario, as we are looking at here, we need a fourth argument. We want to get the answers out of the second column. Type comma. We want the word false. You can either type the word false or put in the number zero. Press enter key. And we will get the correct answer. And before copying this, since we don't have a range name, we need to make this an absolute address. Press F2 key. Highlight the address of the table. We'll simply press F4 here. And then Ctrl plus Enter. And then simply double click to make this work properly. So, in every case here, we are seeing the correct answers.